I've just returned back from the delivery of Team SEA from the UK to Genoa to the International Boat Show taking place and it was my final trip on the boat. Very sad to end what's been an 18 month project for me but I was lucky to be able to speak on behalf of Women in Sport Media to Liz Wardley and Sophie Sizik to see just how they feel now it's been announced that Team SEA will not continue in the Volvo Ocean Race. For me personally, it was a bit of a disappointment. We've created such a phenomenon, such a momentum in women's offshore sailing. And it's disappointing to have to feel like you're starting again to try and get the support and the funding in place for us to continue in the race. Women offshore sailing to continue at a high profile at the top of the game. And also for me personally to try and do a better job than I did last time, because we've learned so much. It'd be nice to go and do it again and do it better. So. I feel it was a nice end to a project that sad that it has to end but it ended with me skippering the boat and I enjoyed that with a great group of people on board spending time with them just before we all go our separate ways but I've got my fingers crossed that we're going to get back together get the funding in place and get some more more girls into the sport and go on to do bigger and better things who knows we might even see a mixed team in the next edition of the Volvo Ocean Race but let's see what Liz and Sophie thought and what they're going to do now that the project's come to an end. <laughs>